In this video, LED driver HD16K33 is interfaced with Arduino and is programmed in C to display alphanumeric characters on a 4-digit 14-segment display. The HD16K33 is similar to the Mac 7219 IC, which is an LED driver and a key scanner. It has onboard 16 bytes of RAM, which is used to map different patterns on the 14 segment display. The driver has a dimming circuit which allows us to have 16 brightness levels on the display. The IC is interfaced to a microcontroller using I2C connection and we can connect up to eight of these devices to the microcontroller and the initial or the default address is 70 and we can change the address by changing hardwiring the address lines A0, A1 and A2 to have up to 8 addresses. Before we display any data on the 14 segment screen we need to initialize the HD16K33 by programming uh, some of the uh, setup registers on the IC. So we have the system setup register where the bit here, the least significant bit will determine whether the oscillator is on or off. For zero means we are in the standby mode. One means the normal operational mode. We also need to program the display setup register so that we determine whether the display is on or off based on the least significant bit here. And these two bits here, B0 and B1, determine whether we have blinking on or blinking off. 0, 0 means the blinking is off, zero, 01 blinking is at 2 Hz frequency, 10 is at 1 Hz, and 11 at 0.5 Hz. We can also control the dimming of the 14 segment display by sending the dimming command. And the 4 bits here, the least significant nibble, will determine the dimming level or the brightness level from the minimum brightness to the maximum brightness. The 14 segment digit can display one of the alphanumeric characters shown here. The character is represented by a 15 bit value which is shown here. So if we want to display let's say the character A, this is the 15 bit value we need to send to the display which has this hexy value. So here this table shows you all the letters from A, B to Z and the numerals from 0 to 9. Programming the 4-digit display driven by the HT16K33 begins with initializing the IC by sending a command byte that will put the IC in normal mode and then we send the dimming command and then we send a command that will put the display on and the blinking off. After initialization, we send the address of the digit where we want to display at. The address of this digit is 0 and the address of this digit is 6. After we allocate the address, we send the 16-bit data of the character. First we send the low byte and then we send the high byte. This circuit diagram shows the interfacing of the 4-digit 14-segment display with the Arduino through the I2C connection. In this first demonstration, we display the B character on digit 0. A quick look at the C sketch. We'll be using the wire library so that we establish I2C communication with the HT16K33. Within the setup function, we execute this function so that we initialize the I2C of the microcontroller and then we call this function to initialize the HD16K33. Within the initialization function, we first send the I2C address of the HD16K33 and then we send this uh, command byte so that we put the driver in normal operation mode and then we send this command byte so that we set the brightness level of the display 
and then we send this command byte so that the display is on and the blinking is off. Back inside the setup function, we call this function and we send two values. The first value is the address of digit 0. And the second value is the 16-bit value of the B character to be displayed. Inside function display alphanumeric, we receive the digit address and the 16-bit character value. And then we send the uh, digit address to the device. And then we send the low byte of the 16-bit character. And then we send the high byte. In this next demonstration, we display the character on digit 3. In this next demonstration, we will display decimal from 0 to 9999. After we include the wire library, we declare two arrays, number and letter. Number will have the 16-bit hexy values for digit 0 to 9 and letter will have the 16-bit hexy value for the alphabets from A to Z. Within the loop function, we will call display text to display the word play. Inside function display text, we will display the letter P and then L, A, and then Y. Back inside the loop function and after we display the word play for three seconds, we call this function display clear to clear the four digit display. After clearing the display, we use this four level nested for loop to display the counts from 0 to 9999. As mentioned earlier, we can connect up to 8 of these HD16K33 modules to a microcontroller by using the slave address shown here, the 7-bit value. The least significant bit determines whether we are reading from the IC or whether we are writing to the IC. These three bits here, A0, A1, and A2, give us the 8 different addresses based on the address lines on the module for A0, A1, and A2. By default, these lines are open, so the address is 70 hexadecimal. By soldering these lines, we can get eight different addresses all the way to address 77. In this demonstration, we have two modules connected to the Arduino over the same I2C bus. The first module has slave address hexadecimal 70 while the second has address 71. The demonstration shows the displaying of numerals from 0 to 9 and the letters from A to Z. Inside the setup function we call this function to initialize the first module which has address hexadecimal 70 and then we call this function to initialize the second module which has address 71 and then we call this function to clear the four digit display of the first module and then we call this function to clear the four digit display of the second module within the loop function we call this function to display the numerals from 0 to 9 and then we call this function to display the letters from A to Z in future videos the HD16K33 display will be used to display sensor measurements. Thank you for watching.